Hey everyone, I'm Marina. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here for a shop update preview. The shop update will be this Friday, July 22nd at 8 p.m. Eastern Time at pineappleyarn.com. Before I get started with the shop update preview, I'd like to remind you about my August clubs. So I will be offering, or I am offering in the shop right now, my August Fiber Club, which is a mystery fiber for all of you hand spinners out there. I also have my mini mystery club, which is a set of three mini skeins in your choice of sock weight or DK weight. And then I also have my sun club, which is my bold and bright neon club. And I take all my inspiration from the mood board every month. All of these clubs will ship out around August 11th and they will close at the end of the month. So you can choose between a one-time purchase or a subscription. They're so fun to get a little something for yourself in the mail every month. So definitely check those out. I also have my advent calendar for this year still available in the shop. These are pre-orders right now and I will be closing them maybe maybe in the next couple of months, maybe in a month and a half. <laughs> so anyway, so many of you have already pre-ordered them. Thank you so much if you are one of those who already have yours for this year. And if you've been on the fence about it, definitely check them out. They're so fun and such a great way to treat yourself during the holiday season. I love this mood board this year. It's just full of warm tones, very like West Coast vibe, just so fun. And it's so nice to have a cheerful kind of beachy themed advent calendar during the holidays, especially for some of you who have crazy cold weather during December. So I love saving mine actually until February. <laughs> for some reason, after the holidays, I love to, you know, get get over the holidays and get everything kind of back to normal and wait until February to open mine. I know it's, it's crazy. It's not Advent at all, but that's just how I do mine. <laughs> so you don't have to do it during the holidays. You can definitely do it anytime you want. And so anyway, there's tons of more information about this calendar. So if you're interested, check it out using the link below. All right, all that being said, I have a really fun kit for you this month, as well as some tonals and some other goodies that I'll be stocking in the shop. So let's go check those out. So the first things that I will have available in the shop are some spinning fiber. This is called Sunrise Surfing. I will have this colorway on three different fibers. This is Superwash Merino Nylon. This is Merino Baby Alpaca and Hollow Glitter. And some of you might recognize this blend. This is a custom blend that I carry in the shop every now and again and I'm obsessed with this, like absolutely love it. I think it's beautiful and it just has just a little touch of sparkle, which is so beautiful. Um, I developed this blend for the shop and I just, I love dyeing on it and I love spinning it. So I will have that custom blend available and then I will also have it on South Down and South Down is just a it's a really easy fiber to spin and it's fabulous for hard wearing accessories. So I will have this colorway on all these different fibers and let me show you two other colorways I'll be stocking. The next colorway I'll be stocking is called Mermaid Galaxy and it's just this super fun blend of purples and teals and pinks and i just i love it it's so so fun and again i will have this all available on superwash merino nylon south down and the custom blend of merino baby alpaca and hollow glitter so this is just a really really fun colorway to spin and I had a fun time thinking of all these names for these fibers this month it was really fun 
the next one and the final colorway is sea turtle swim and so this is just a gorgeous blend of different kinds of greens and blues i thought it looked like just very oceany really loved these so this one is superwash merino nylon and the custom blend of merino baby alpaca and hollow glitter and then this is south down so i wanted to do several different options for the fibers this month i wanted to do a non-superwash hard wearing fiber so if you wanted to spin a pair of socks uh, using a non-superwash and using um, or without nylon south down is really great of course you can you can make other things from it but south down is a really nice fiber that doesn't felt easily even though it's non superwash it's a really great fiber um, and then of course the superwash merino nylon all of the colors just pop on this so with the addition of nylon and with the superwash fiber it just it really really makes colors pop and then one thing I like about the superwash is that it leaves a lot of white in it. So as you can see, there's white here and there, and it makes a beautiful barber pulled yarn. It obviously you could chain ply it for um, for less of a marled look, but I love using the superwash merino nylon for just a beautiful two ply barber pull effect. It's so so pretty, and all those. Um, those white areas like this one you can see some white areas in here it really helps the colorway stay light and bright not too muddy not too dense i i really like it and obviously the custom blend i mean i created this blend so i'm very partial to it but this is just soft 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 this blend is and it is non-super wash so you have those uh qualities to it but it has that little pop of glitter in it and I just love it. So those are the fibers that will be available this month. And um, I hope for all of you spinners, you've really been into Tour de Fleece. I know I've been having a great time spinning this month. And so maybe you've spun your stash down enough where you need to restock a little bit. <laughs> That's kind of how I've been feeling. I've, I've been spinning a lot out of my stash and uh, feel like it might be time to stock up on some fibers here. The next items I want to share with you are four different tonals that I'll have in the shop. I love look at these colors together. Aren't these just beautiful? I, I did not intend for these to go so well together, but they really do. <laughs> They're so beautiful. So the colorways I will be restocking are Clearwater, Cloud9, Princess, and Solar Flare. And all these just look so pretty together. I, I love how bright they are. These, if you wanted to do all four together, they would be really pretty in a project altogether. But I was looking at these two for a project. I think these would just be so beautiful and unexpected. These are two colors that maybe I wouldn't put together, but I thought these two would be so, so pretty together, clear water and solar flare. And of course you can't beat purple and pink together. <laughs> so um, these tonals, some of them will be, I will have a lot, some I'll have a few skeins. Um, it just kind of depended how much time I had this month to get these dyed up, but I have been running low in a lot of my tonals. So I wanted to make sure to get a good amount of tonals in the shop um, for your projects. So those will be restocked. The next item I will be putting in the shop, I'm so excited about this. This is my latest kit. It is called Mermaid Lagoon and I love how this turned out. I saw this fabric and I absolutely had to get it. It's just this gorgeous motif of mermaids and little jellyfish and seahorses. And one thing I love about this fabric, besides that it has mermaids and it's ocean themed, <laughs> is because it actually has a little bit of gold metallic accents. So 
a little bit here and in the mermaid's hair these are all um, shiny gold metallics I don't know if that will even be able to be captured here but it's just a little bit of shine a little bit of bling I think it's really really pretty so as with all of my other um, kits that I've had this summer you will have your choice of the medium sized kit and the larger size kits which is a really good sized bag for your large projects or to hold several smaller projects every bag will include one of these adorable pineapple charms those are on all of my project bags and i just think that they're so cute and i love these project bags um, because they have a box bottom they open up and i like to roll mine down when i'm knitting with uh, say a single skein or maybe two skeins i like to kind of fold mine down on the top and just use it for a nice little um almost like a knitting bowl it holds a cake of yarn really well or a ball of yarn and sits up and you can just knit straight from that so um, with the interfacing in the bag it holds its shape it's really nice and i should show you the lining it's so so pretty this is like kind of periwinkle blue lining is just so so pretty so this is the medium size and then the large size is this size so you can see with the yarn um, next to me here you can see kind of the scale of these and of course i have i'll have measurements on my website so you can see if those will work for you so in this kit you will get you will receive one of these project bags and i also dyed up some coordinating yarn and i just love the colors in this i took some artistic license because i just couldn't get over the fact that there wasn't a super bright pink in this i i think it needed some <laughs> so i added some bright pink but i really picked up a lot of kind of the teals and some of the kind of turquoise colors but maybe toned down with a little bit of gray some purple and then i also put in some i don't know if you can see this but i do have some warm areas in here to bring out the gold in the bag and of course some speckles all around <laughs> so i think these turned out so pretty this yarn is just so so gorgeous so all of the yarn will be uh, fingering white yarn. I call this base Nani Twist. It's just like my gold Nani Twist base, but without the gold Stellina. So this is a sock weight yarn. It's an 80-20 Superwash Merino nylon blend. And every time I dye with this, I wonder why I don't dye with this more often because it is really cushy and plump and it knits into the best socks. Um, of course, you can use it for any project but if you are into sock knitting this um, this blend is really really nice but any of these tonals would go well with it if you wanted to coordinate those so I ha must have had all these kind of tonals on my mind <laughs> when I dyed this up because all of these are just really really beautiful with this mermaid lagoon kit Last but certainly not least, the kit will include this adorable stitch marker. And this was created by my daughter who has an Etsy shop, which I'll link below. But this just is the coolest stitch marker. It's a little sea urchin. And I just think it coordinates so well with this kit. And with all of my stitch markers and progress keepers, it will have a lever back clasp, which is very easy to open and close. It's, it's uh, larger than like a lobster clasp, and I like that a lot because you can not only use it for a stitch marker you can also use it as a progress keeper and it is just great because 
it is so functional. So those are the three items that will be included in this month's knitting kit. And I hope you love it. I just, I loved coming up with this and creating this beautiful kit and coming up with the yarn. It is just so much fun. So I hope you enjoy it as well. Now the final product I actually can't show you. I will probably just insert a black and white photo here, <laughs> but I am going to be putting into the shop a bunch of mystery skeins. And uh, these are all yarn, the fingering weight yarn that have maybe a little speckle on them, a little errant speckle, a little um, mistake, or maybe I didn't dye the colorway right, or uh, maybe a discontinued colorway. So these, again, these will all be fingering weight skeins. They will come in a set of three, and I am pricing them very, very low to make room for new inventory. So uh, that is the reasoning behind just a really, it's a really great price for three, uh, three skeins of yarn. And um, they're great, you know, if you're looking to beef up your stash or if you maybe want to have a surprise and get your creative juices flowing with maybe a colorway you wouldn't normally buy. Um, I know I love mystery skeins. It always kind of pushes me outside my comfort zone and helps me come up with some new color combinations. So those will come in sets of three. And like I said, they're all fingering weight. And I will have an option um, to purchase a skein of Noe Mohair Silk. This is a lace weight, very, very soft and um, I will have those priced individually. So either way, whichever one you choose, um, they're just a really great, great price and just so fun to have a little mystery, have a little, little mystery in your mailbox. Well, that is it for my update this month. Um, I also did want to mention that I have restocked all of the soak wash in my shop. So if you are interested, especially in pineapple grove, that has proved to be a really popular scent. I understand why, because it's my favorite as well. But if you're interested in that, definitely check out the shop. And uh, this update may be one of the last updates I do for a while. Um, I really am going to work on dyeing all of my advent calendars and putting those together. So I may or may not have updates in the next few months. So I wanted to give you a heads up in case you are interested in picking up some yarn. Um, it will probably be a bit before I restock anything. Of course, I will leave my custom order uh, link. So I will leave that open. So I will link it below. And I will also obviously keep open all of my clubs. So those will continue to be available as well. But other than that, thank you so much for joining me today. I would love if you would give this video a thumbs up. If you found it fun and you like looking at yarn as much as I do, I hope you found it interesting and just, yeah, just really enjoyable looking at all this beautiful yarn. So I hope to see you this Friday, July 22nd at 8 p.m. Eastern time at pineappleyarn.com. And I will also be uploading an episode in the next couple days. So keep an eye out for that. I hope that you are having so much fun with your crafting and I will see you next time. Bye.